Now I'm going to show you how to make one of these five sided boxes. Now that could be an icicle, could be a unicorn, could be a Christmas tree. You can do all sorts of things with it once you've made it. Now what you have to do first is print out the design that you want, the size that you want. Doesn't matter, it's the same demonstration for whatever size you do. This is for the A4 size. And once you've printed that out, just cut it out roughly and stick it onto the card, paper, whatever you want, that you want to cut it out of. Now I've got this one here. Now where you've got the dotted lines, that's where we're going to fold. And where we've got the straight lines, that's where we're going to cut. So I've got a ruler here. And I'm just going to carefully, using a embossing tool, just gently score through that. Because you could use this template three or four times and then uh, put it in your uh, box that you want to make paper mache from maybe don't waste anything you're a crafter so just do that with all of the dotted lines and then cut it out once you've cut it out there goes me there goes me implement it ends up like this so there's your template. You could use that a second time if you want to. And as you can see here, see here, I've already folded it over. Where the score lines was, it will naturally fold. And then all you've got to do is take a embossing tool and uh, I've got a bone folder here. Just give yourself a really nice tight crease there. And then all you've got to do is stick that together. So the first thing I'm going to do is stick these flaps to the bottom here first. And I've got a good quality glue here that allows you to do that. So just apply a little glue onto the base there. And then just hold that in position and stick that down. Now I've stuck the four flaps on the end there together. It just leaves a little flap here that's going to tuck inside. So again, just a little bit of glue on there. If you want to stick it permanently, otherwise you can just tuck that in, it will hold itself together. And there you can see the five sided box there is totally stuck together. Alternatively, if you wanted to, you could stick the bases along the side here first and then do the little flaps at the end last. It's entirely up to you. So now as you can see that would make a nice icicle like that. Or as you could say you could use it as a unicorn horn or you could even use it as a Christmas tree. Very simple and easy to do. Or your very own shard. Mm.